got it. I've never looked inside. I like the case so far. Now getting into the We're cooking with oil. Chaka. It locks in place. Well, let me turn the doorway towards you. Can you get the gist of this bad boy? Ah. I'm sorry it has such a hard time putting it together. Home sweet home. One flap so far. And I see. Commonly, I have to fight these poles everywhere I come. I go camping, and these things pop right in place. But I gotta admit, it's a little arduous. I just gotta get the, the hang of it. It seems well constructed. I like the color. Squeaks. Um, there's plenty of room in there. There's there's a pouch in there for uh, your iPhone, your iPad. Right on the side here. Now yeah, three more. <coughs> Two. Wait a minute. Start over. One. And there's two. Three. And poor guy. Uh, all in all, it's a sweet tent though. For its purpose, I like it. I'm gonna give it a two snaps and a swirl. What I see immediately is the convenience for children having it in the trunk and popping it out on the go instead of putting up an arduous 15-pole tent. I did struggle with it a little bit, but I'll get that practice down. Uh, overall, I like it. It has a rain guard included, already installed. I strongly suggest that you stake this tent because it'll catch air and be like a parachute and take off with all your belongings into the river. And share the instructions that came with it. The nice uh, pop-up tent. If you can see this, kind of hard to follow, uh, a bit ambiguous, I would say. So uh, I'd like a little bit more clarity when I have instructions, but I figured it out. As you notice, it's a little struggling. But uh, that would be my only suggestion: is more defined definition in your instructions. But great product, thank you. This part is a little. 
a bit. Well, let's say tedious. But I feel like double string. Good upper pec workout too. You notice. I love it, love it, love it, love it. Just gotta get used to it. Sweet, boom. Center. And then, it's like a big spider. Isn't it? Short bus to school was lonely. I like it. It's so obscure to me. Nothing like we grow up with. There we go. You're going to want to, uh, when you break the poles down, I've noticed, is pull out to release the knuckle. Otherwise, you'll be going against much, much stress. So in the visual, this is all I have to do. Just pull the lift up. And with the help of my assistant, Sleep, store it in the RV or in the trunk. As always, things are bigger after you pull them out, but let's see. And you dig it. Not bad. 